Peace. Real quick, I wanted to introduce you to my most recent project that I've worked on. This is my 15th book that I published. It's called Eyes Wide Shut, The Science of Secret Societies. And I just published an article about it to give you some of the backstory of why I actually published this book. Just go to my website, Asia, at www.atlantisschool.blogspot.com and you can read some of that backstory there. I also have links to Eyes Wide Shut. My e-store is located on my website at Quinaya Publishing. You can go to Google, just put in Quinaya Publishing, Q-U-A-N-A-A-H Publishing. It'll take you to my website, go to the products tab, and then you'll see this title as well as my other titles that you can purchase through my e-store. It's also available on Barnes & Noble and Amazon and Amazon Kindle. If you go to Amazon, Amazon Kindle, or Barnes & Noble, just search under my pen name, S. Quinaya, Q-U-A-N-A-A-H, and Eyes Wide Shut as well as my other titles will come up, and you can purchase it through those particular outlets as well. Now, one of the things that really inspired me for writing this book is because over the years I saw that there was a lot of misinformation and disinformation out there in terms of what secret societies are and how they function as special interest groups. So through my experience, through my research, I consolidated all of that and put it in the form of a manuscript that people can reference in order to have a comprehensive understanding about secret societies and how they function as special interest groups. And I have not been shy in saying this, that this is the most comprehensive book to date about secret societies as special interest groups, especially from a 5% perspective, because through the years I've realized that you may find bits and pieces here or there, but nothing in a consolidated form such as this book. And one of the other things that I talk about is a lot of the things that I put in this book, you will not be able to Google. You will not find online because some of this information that I acquired over the years was before there was the internet, before there was Google because this research and this study goes back well over two decades. So yeah, let me show you some of the stuff that I have in here. Um, those of you that have, may have a little bit more of a deeper understanding of like Freemasonry, you may be familiar with the term riding the goat. Um, so I have a chapter that talks about riding the goat to give you some insight into that. Um, there are various different um, catechisms in the Masonic order or questions and answers that initiates learn. I have a lot of those master mason catechisms in this book that you will not find no other places unless you are a part of the lodge or for some you know strange reason you come across that information but you won't find it online. Another thing that I talk about is some of the history of Angelo Solomon, who was basically the first um, black mason who was initiated into a, a white lodge in Europe. So I talk about him. You know, so there's a lot of information in this book. Um, I go through the shrine, you know, the shriners, and I talk about that, and I talk about the Masonic Constitution and a lot of things that that you will not find online from this perspective and for those people who are studious and you're interested in things like this then I would definitely encourage you to pick this book up if you know of people family members of friends that are interested in stuff like this then this is definitely a good investment for them as well so again I just wanted to take a moment to let y'all know um, about this project that I just put out. Um, if you wanted to check it out, go to my website, Quinaya Publishing, um, Q-U-A-N-A-A-H, Publishing. Just put that in Google. It'll take you there. Go to the Products tab, and you'll see that title along with my other titles. And, you know, also I encourage you again to check out my website and read the recent article that I've published in terms of some of the backstory of why I published this book. You can go there at www.AtlantisSchool.com dot blogspot dot com um, I will this was inspiring empowering it was educating and you know those of you who've already picked the book I definitely appreciate it I just released it last week 
and many of you have already gotten a book and have already started to reach out to me in terms of what you think about it and I definitely appreciate that type of support also go to Amazon or Barnes and Noble and put a review up there for me let other people know what you thought about the book as well because there's nothing like an honest genuine perspective from those people who actually are doing this research and learning this for themselves so thanks again i appreciate it and peace